<laughs> Once upon a time, in a kingdom rich with tradition and mystery, there lived a princess named Amina. From the moment of her birth, she was destined for greatness, yet a dark shadow loomed over her future. As Amina blossomed into a young woman, suitors from far and wide sought her hand in marriage. But each time a potential husband approached, a strange and inexplicable phenomenon occurred. With a flash of light and a hiss like a thunder, Princess Amina would transform into a powerful python, leaving her suitors trembling in fear. Without the knowledge of anyone, the origin of this cause lay buried in the secrets of the past. Amina's mother, Queen Zara, had harbored a forbidden love for another man, a love that defied the sacred bonds of marriage. Consumed by shame and fear of consequences, Queen Zara chose to keep her transgression a secret from her husband. As years passed by, Amina grew more into a radiant young woman. The truth of her heritage remained shrouded in darkness. But as the time for her to get married approaches, and she still couldn't get married, the gods got angry and could no longer ignore the sins of the queen. <laughs> they unleashed their wrath upon her in the form of relentless torment, manifesting in two strange and uncertain ways. The queen's body became a battleground for the forces of good and evil as Margot emerged from her flesh and her soul cried out in agony. The king was disturbed about what has befallen his household, so he demanded an answer. In a desperate bid to save herself, Queen Zara clung to her secrets, refusing to confess her sins as her body withered and decayed. But the gods were unyielding in their demand for justice. They declared that through honesty and confession could the queen hope to find redemption. At the blink of death, with her spirit hovering between this world and the next, Queen Zara finally relented. With tears in her eyes and a voice choked with rumors, she confessed her betrayer to her husband and her people. But it was too late for forgiveness to grant her salvation, for her sins had already claimed her life. The king was directed and was given solution to the right steps that would get the princess whole again. A ceremony was held as the gods demanded. Amina was purified in the seven waters of sacred rivers. Her spirit was cleansed from darkness that had blocked her lineage. Yet, despite her newfound purity, the stain of her mother's sin lingered, casting a shadow over her prospects for marriage. And so, Amina remained single, as the villagers kept spreading the news of her past to anyone who wants to marry her. Subscribe to my channel for more amazing videos.